Have you always lived alone? Out in the wilderness, as an apostate? For the most part. Would that not be incredibly trying? People could be trying. Mankind, most of all. That... is an excellent point. Redcliffe Village should be just ahead. I want a constant watch on that damned thing. Sound the alarm at the first sign of demons. Turn back. We can't open it until the threat has passed. What's that? We don't know what these rifts can do. That one appeared to alter the time around it.
we spread word the Inquisition was coming. But you should know that no one here was expecting us. No one? Not even Grand Enchanter Fiona? If she was, she hasn't told anyone. We've arranged use of the tavern for the negotiations. Agents of the Inquisition, my apologies. Magister Alexius is in charge now, but hasn't yet arrived. He's expected shortly. You can speak with the former Grand Enchanter in the meantime. The Vale is weaker here than in Haven. And not merely weak, but altered in a way I have not seen. again last night. No, there'll be no talk of this. It was so real. <laughs> Too many people dying for want of simple herbs. My apologies. Can I help you? Are you running short of healing herbs? Yes. We've many injured from attacks by those cursed Templars. I need the herbs to treat people's wounds. It's too dangerous to go hunting through the hills to gather more. I've a list there of the herbs I need. There are refugees at the crossroads who would benefit from a healer. Of course they would. These attacks by the Templars have endangered countless innocent lives. But if I go to the crossroads to help, I might end up in danger myself. I doubt those refugees would risk their lives for a knife here. Why should I risk mine for them? The Inquisition honors the efforts of all who are willing to help in these dark times. Help the refugees, and we will ensure that you are protected and respected. All right. If the Inquisition soldiers are there, I might be safer regardless. I'll see you at the crossroads soon. Just give me a moment to gather my things. May I help you? Are you running short of healing herbs? Yes, I need them to keep wounds from going bad. It's too dangerous to go hunting through the hills to gather more. I've a list there of the herbs I need. Goodbye. Stay safe out there. May I help you? I found some of the herbs you were looking for. Thank you. Are you running short of healing herbs? Yes. I need them to keep wounds from going bad. It's too dangerous to go hunting through the hills to gather more. I've a list there of the herbs I need. Goodbye. Thank you so much for your help. Pleasure to see you again. I found some of the herbs you were looking for. This is exactly what I needed. Are you running short of healing herbs? Yes. I need them to keep wounds from going bad. It's too dangerous to go hunting through the hills to gather more. I've a list there of the herbs I need. Goodbye. Thank you so much for your help. Pleasure to see you again. Goodbye. Thank you so much for your help. A pleasure to see you again. 
I found some of the herds you were looking for. This is exactly what I needed. Goodbye. Thank you so much for your help. A pleasure to see you again. Goodbye. Thank you so much for your help. The dead or hiding. We should be getting more refugees soon. Do you think we should get them into the village? I'm not sure there's enough food. about your people they say a spirit dwells in a small lake south of the highway the girls of the village bring it daisies and ask for love but rarely does it listen for it is a spirit of valor not love and it favors blood lotus flowers they say a desire demon took the mind of our young lord connor it cost the boy his life Cursed be the blood mage who led the lad down such a path. What if I took flowers to your wife's shrine for you? I... I do not know what to say, except thank you. You are Dalish. My sinner and I, we kept to the old ways as we could. Though I know we are as children to you. Her shrine lies on a hill to the west, near the table stones. Thank you. Stay safe. Walk in peace. Please, are you with the Inquisition? As you've wandered, have you by any chance seen a ram that is, um, different? Lord Wolseley wandered off, and he's very special. If you could find him, I'd be most grateful. What makes your ram so special? Well, he's always brought the family luck. 
and his advice helped us make our fortune. Your ram offered advice? He's a very special ram. Your ram has gone missing? Yes. I'm certain that if he heard his Jimmy missed him, he'd come right back. He's likely at our family's old summer cabin. It's by the lake in the southern hills. If you do find him and send him back, I'd be happy to pay you. I'll speak with you later. If you find my ram, please send him home. Welcome, Agents of the Inquisition. What has brought you to Redcliffe? We're here because of your invitation back in Val Royale. You must be mistaken. I haven't been to Val Royale since before the Conclave. If it wasn't you who invited me here, who was it? I... I don't know. Now that you say it, I feel strange. Whoever or whatever brought you here, the situation has changed. The free mages have already pledged themselves to the service of the Tevinter Imperium. An alliance with Tevinter? Do you not fear all of Thedas turning against you? Andras Tezas. I'm trying to think of a single worse thing you could have done, and I've got nothing. I understand that you are afraid, but you deserve better than slavery to Devinter. As one indenture to a Magister, I no longer have the authority to negotiate with you. Very well. Who is in charge now? Welcome, my friends. I apologize for not greeting you earlier. Agents of the Inquisition, allow me to introduce Magister Girion Alexius. The Southern Mages are under my command. And you are the survivor, yes? The one from the Fade? Interesting. I haven't seen any sign of Redcliffe's Arl or his men. The Arl of Redcliffe left the village. Arl Tegan did not abandon his lands during the Blight, even when they were under siege. There were tensions growing. I did not want an incident. I'd like to know more about this alliance between the rebel mages and the Imperium. Certainly. What specifically do you wish to know? The Grand Enchanter told me she was indentured to a Magister. Our Southern Brethren have no legal status in the Imperium. As they were not born citizens of Tevinta, they must work for a period of ten years before gaining full rights. As their protector, I shall oversee their work for the Imperium. I'm here to get mages to close the breach. Right, to business. I understand, of course. Felix, would you send for a scribe, please? Pardon my manners. My son Felix, friends. I am not surprised you're here. Containing the breach is not a feat that many could even attempt. There is no telling how many mages would be needed for such an endeavor. Ambitious, indeed. I'll take every mage you can give me. There will have to be. Felix. I'm so sorry. Please forgive my clumsiness, my lady. 
Are you all right? I'm fine, Father. Come, I'll get your powders. Please excuse me, friends. We will have to continue this another time. Fiona, I require your assistance back at the castle. I don't mean to trouble everyone. I shall send word to the Inquisition. We will conclude this business at a later date. Come to the Chantry. You are in danger. Ooh, very mysterious. We'll be careful, but we need to figure out what's going on here. We don't need your guns here. Your Inquisition's just Templars by another name. Who are you? Linnea. Just Linnea. Don't ask what Circle Tower I'm from, because we're done with that. We're all free mages now. You'd rather bow to Tevinter than join the Inquisition. All you Chantry types think the same way. The Imperium is a great evil that must be avoided. It's just because they're ruled by mages. No one wants us to look at them and say their mages are free and the world hasn't ended. But don't magisters summon demons and practice human sacrifice? The Chantry says whatever they think will scare us. What's wrong with blood magic? People don't like the idea of us controlling their thoughts, but they have no problem with us throwing fireballs in their walls. In Tevinter, the mages police themselves. It works. Tevinter's as big a threat as the Templars. You're better off with the Inquisition. Right. And I'm the Empress of Orlais. you'd gotten here sooner. These two winters make my shoulder blades itch. You're not happy with this new alliance. Something's not right about that lot. They're not like us. Magic or no, I'd rather count myself among decent folk than stand with Magisters. Who are you? Name's Tolman. Formerly of the Circle of Magi in Hospital. Lived my whole life there. Since I was ten years old and came into my magic. Three meals a day. Quality education. A roof over my head. If you're not summoning demons, a mage tower's a fine place to be. If you were happy in the Circle, why are you here with the rebels? We're all rebels now. The vote to sort of that. The majority wanted to dissolve the Circles. The rest of us went with them and were cut loose. I figured I'm better off with my fellow mages than on my own. How did the Grand Enchanter end up working with Tevinter? One minute, we were bracing for the Templars to attack. The next, we had a Magister ally. It was a stroke of luck that's given us an edge. In a way. Out of the frying pan. Goodbye. Be careful. The Tevinters likely aren't happy you're asking questions. Go be with you. You all right, sir? Of course.
after all. Either way, we're safe. Make her watch over you. Are you a Chantry sister? A lay sister only. I work here to help the poor and extend the Maker's kindness to those who need it. It is very busy work, especially in these times, but let me know if I can ever help you. I found the letter you sent a Templar named Corin. What? Shit. You can't prove anything. A letter from a rogue Templar. Nobody is going to care. So, what do you intend to do? Let's see. Impersonating a sister, smuggling, dishonoring Chantry Rose. I can think of more if you like. Or you could put your skills to use for the Inquisition. And you'd keep quiet? Nobody else has to know? That will depend on how honest your efforts are on our behalf. All right, I'm in. Seems like the Inquisition is the safer bet these days. I look forward to helping the Inquisition, as per our agreement. You're finally here. Now help me close this, would you? that work exactly <laughs> you don't even know do you you just wiggle your fingers and boom rift closes who are you ah getting ahead of myself again I see Dorian of house Parvis, most recently of Minrathus how do you do another Tevinter. be cautious with this one suspicious friends you have here magister Alexius was once my mentor so my assistance should be valuable, as I'm sure you can imagine. I was expecting Felix to be here. I'm sure he's on his way. He was to give you the note, then meet us here after ditching his father. Alexius couldn't jump to Felix's side fast enough when he pretended to be faint. Is something wrong with him? He's had some lingering illness for months. Felix is an only child, and Alexius is being a mother hen, most likely. Are you a magister? All right. 
Let's say this once. I'm a mage from Tevinter, but not a member of the Magisterium. I know Southerners use the terms interchangeably, but that only makes you sound like barbarians. Are you the one who sent that note, then? I am. Someone had to warn you, after all. Look, you must know there's danger. That should be obvious, even without the note. Let's start with Alexius claiming the allegiance of the mage rebels out from under you. As if by magic, yes? Which is exactly right. To reach Redcliffe, before the Inquisition, Alexius distorted time itself. I hope that's less dangerous than it sounds. More. That is fascinating, if true, and almost certainly dangerous. The rift you closed here. You saw how it twisted time around itself, sped some things up and slowed others down? Soon, there will be more like it, and they'll appear further and further away from Redcliffe. The magic Alexius is using is wildly unstable, and it's unraveling the world. You're asking me to take a lot on faith. I know what I'm talking about. I helped develop this magic. When I was still his apprentice, it was pure theory. Alexius could never get it to work. What I don't understand is why he's doing it. Ripping time to shreds just to gain a few hundred lackeys? He didn't do it for them. Took you long enough. Is he getting suspicious? No, but I shouldn't have played the illness card. I thought he'd be fussing over me all day. My father's joined a cult, to Vinter Supremacists. They call themselves Venatori. And I can tell you one thing. Whatever he's done for them, he's done it to get to you. Why would he rearrange time and indenture the Mage Rebellion just to get to me? They're obsessed with you, but I don't know why. Perhaps because you survived the Temple of Sacred Ashes. You can close the rifts. Uh, maybe there's a connection. Will they see you as a threat? If the Venatori are behind those rifts or the breach in the sky, they're even worse than I thought. Do you have any suggestions? You know you're his target. Expecting the trap is the first step in turning it to your advantage. I can't stay in Redcliffe. Alexius doesn't know I'm here, and I want to keep it that way for now. But whenever you're ready to deal with him, I want to be there. I'll be in touch. Oh, and Felix, try not to get yourself killed. There are worse things than dying, Dorian. Greetings. Greetings. Heaven has been filled with silence. I will take these injury reports to research. My heart Mother Giselle says we're losing fewer patients to fever thanks to your work. Good. 
Master Dennett's horses are a fine addition to our stables. I will see they are well tended. Let's see what we have. don't have the manpower to take the castle. Either we find another way in, or give up this nonsense and go and get the Templars. Redcliffe is in the hands of a Magister. This cannot be allowed to stand. The letter from Alexius asked for the Herald of Andraste by name. It's an obvious trap. So, we've heard from Magister Alexius. I expected as much. And yet some of us want to sit and do nothing. Not this again. Redcliffe Castle is one of the most defensible fortresses in Ferelden. It has repelled thousands of assaults. If you go in there, you'll die. And we'll lose the only means we have of closing these rifts. I won't allow it. And if we don't even try to meet Alexius, we lose the mages and leave a hostile foreign power on our doorstep. Even if we could assault the keep, it would be for naught. An Orlesian Inquisition's army marching into Ferelden would provoke a war. Our hands are tied. The Magister... ...has outplayed us. We can't just give up. There has to be something we can do. 
We cannot accept defeat now. There must be a solution. Where is the Isle of Redcliffe? I'm sure he'd help us get his castle back. After he was displaced, Arl Tegan rode straight for Dunarin to petition the Crown for help. I doubt he'll want our assistance once the Ferelden army lays siege to his castle. Wait. There is a secret passage into the castle, an escape route for the family. It's too narrow for our troops, but we could send agents through. Too risky. Those agents will be discovered well before they reach the Magister. That's why we need a distraction. Perhaps the envoy Alexius wants so badly. While they're focused on Lavelle, we break the Magister's defenses. It could work, but it's a huge risk. Fortunately, you'll have help. This man says he has information about the Magister and his methods, Commander. Your spies will never get past Alexius's magic without my help. So if you're going after him, I'm coming along. The plan puts you in the most danger. We can't in good conscience order you to do this. We can still go after the Templars if you'd rather not play the bait. It's up to you. <laughs> 